everybody, Chester here. Welcome back to Super Mario 64. Last time, we beat Bowser, and we also did as much as we could in Big Boo's Haunt. Well, since we can't do anything in Big Boo's Haunt at the moment, let's go make us do that star that we missed. By unlocking this door, we're finally, finally, we're finally in the basement level of the castle, which is awesome. So, let's go over here. And first of all, before we do anything, before we, um, and when we jump in this world, wow, I didn't know the, um, MIPS is here. Okay, a lot of people have trouble capturing MIPS, so all you really have to do, okay, um, wow. Don't tell me I have to spend, come on, no, I'm just saying how easy MIPS is, and now, okay, now it's gonna run into, got him, alright. Okay, you get a star from him. I think there's three MIPS in this game. So we need to watch out for them. So yeah, we got our 35th star. I would like to save. And also, speaking of getting free stars, let's talk to this toad right here! Okay, let me get my best toad voice on. Hold on your hat! If you lose it, you'll get injured easily! If you lose your cap, you won't have to find it in the course where you lost it. Oh boy, I'm look I'm not looking good for Peach. Oh no. Oh boy, it's not looking good for Peach. She's still trapped somewhere inside the walls. Please, Mara, you have to help her. Do you know where the enemy world is inside the walls? I can't read. Well, here's our star. Our free star. Um, there's three stars in this whole game that you get from toads. So we, we have to look out for the toads that give us a star. Now, that room right there has a world in it, and that's going to be the world that we are going to start off this episode in. But before we do anything else, let's just capture all the secret stars that we can at the moment. Now, there's not a star right here, but if we can read this, or, it's a riddle, and it is, it is, it is decreed that one shall pound the pillars, and as a kid, this riddle stumped me. I don't know why, but... All you really do is just pound these pillars. Like that, and... Well, actually, let's land it this time. Well, if I can actually get on the pillar. And then just hit it like this, and the water recedes. Now we can exit through the door that leads to the moat. Now, if the moat was still up, there would be a cage. This would be caged, but since it's not, we could go in it. Welcome to the Vanish Cap Switch Cores. That is right, we're going to unlock the next Switch Cap. I missed a red coin, so shoot. Um, let's, let's crawl up there and get it. <laughs> so yeah. God, I love the music in this game. Da -da. All right, um, let's get the... Um, I don't know why Mario just likes to break the laws of physics while crawling. But let Mario do his own thing. Next star, or next coin is right here. Three, four, and this, and um, actually the DS remake, the um, the star right, there would be all red coins over here, but since um, it's not the DS remakes, we have to deal with this crap. Um, my game volume is loud, I think it's just because my mic is loud, so let me turn that down just a bit. There we go, normal. Alright, so let's, uh, let's get these. This part was very hard for me. I don't know why it was, but it was hard for me. Five. Six. And then seven. Eight. Oh, it flips, it flips. Alright. And then eight red coin. Where is that at? There it is. And speaking of it... We have now unlocked the Vanish Caps, which are in the blue exclamation mark. Let's actually get it. Get this red coin. And we have another secret star of the castle. Let's get it. Here we go. And since now we have the Vanish Cap, we can now do the star that we have to do in. That's right, Big Boost Haunt. So let's go up here. Oh well, it's not the DS version, so we can't. Damn, dude. Um, well, I'm gonna beat y'all outside in the backyard, so... 
I'm gonna cut away just really quick. Alright guys, we're now in the backyard and let's go inside Big Boo's Hunt and get our last star that we're missing in it. Eye to eye in the secret room. Now, um, you can... I referenced uh, me saying that I hope we don't have to fight a Mr. I. That is the task. I mean task. <laughs> that is the mission. That is the star we have to get. All we really do. I think this is the only way. Okay, just launch up over here for not a quick access. Wow. All right, that was horrifying. Let's try that again. And. There we go, even better. Now, we have to do this super fast for time, so let's do that. And basically, it tells you right there, the wall, go through here, and yeah, we have to fight this Mr. Rye to get the um, star. Now, Mr. Rye's not looking at me. Alright, here we go. And the only way to beat Mr. Rye is just to run around in circles, and yeah, there's our star. Super easy. Here we go. All right, now let's head back into the basement and let's start off the world that we're gonna start this um, episode off. And it's not really one of my favorite worlds, but we're gonna start off with Hazy Maze Cave. So yeah, we're gonna go back into this room and we're gonna go into the metallic metal void shape it looks like mercury honestly Mario just jumped into a pool of fucking mercury now this isn't one of my favorite freaking maps for many reasons um it's just blatant really not that interesting wow now we need to watch out for these rolling rocks um they do have a specific mission uh, it's just nasty so basically our mission right now is the swimming in the beast so yeah the uh, I think the beast right here as you can see well that's our star that we need right now and where is it where, where is it is it behind this rock oh here it is yep and guess what the beast's name is? I think it's named Dory. Alright, I can't... Can't get on it. But yeah, it looks kind of like Lapras. I always called it Lapras as a kid. Like a derpy version... Of Lapras. <laughs> the failed cut art style of Lapras. There you go. Alright, well, we got the first star of Hazy Maze Cave. Not too hard, but it gets harder. Well, not harder, more complicated. Elevate for the red coins! One of the most, um, tedious missions in this game. I mean, in this game. In this world. Um, I had a big hard time on this mission on the DS version for some reason. I have no idea why. But basically, all you really do is just come over here. Yeah, as you can see, all the red coins are in this room. Like, seriously, you just have to stay in this one room for the whole mission. It's not really that hard. You just gotta know what you're doing. As an experienced player like me, I do know what I'm doing, so. Yeah, I think there's uh, red coins in these crates. Yeah, as we saw the, um, the horrible rendering of the N64! <laughs> I don't think there's one in the Mr. Eye. Oh my god, that saved me. I'm pretty sure there's not one in the Mr. I, I hope not. Three. Let me check what the next one is right. Get away from K. Uh, I think the other ones are at the bottom. I'm not sure. I hope it's not where the Mr. I is at, and I hope I'm not wrong. About the red coins being in this only room only. I think I'm wrong on that, by the way. 
Oh crap, I forgot the red coin locations. Oh fuck, I forgot the red coin locations. How did I forget the red coin location? Oh no, 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 no. Alright, here we go. I remember, I remember. I hope I, I hope this is it. Wow, okay, Mario. Great. Okay, just climb up this pole. Got a stripper man Mario this. And, yeah, we just gotta ride this, I think. Yep, we gotta ride this. So, yeah. Um, again, tedious. Wow. You know, I'm surprised that there's not a red coin in this one. In that crate. Okay, five, six, a seven, and eight. Okay, right, yeah, that's all the eight red coins. Yeah, let just get off of that. Oh my goodness, I almost died. Or I almost fell. Wow, that actually took a lot longer than I thought it would take, honestly. Alright, let's see if we can fall on the star. No, we can't. That was a short fall. Damn, dude. Oh my god, we already hit 40 stars. And we're not even... We're just barely now getting to the fourth... The basement level. Damn, dude. Pro. Alright, Metalhead Mario can move. Now, we can't do this mission just yet, but we're in the world on where we can be able to, where we can make ourselves able to do the mission. Let me rephrase my words. Now, to do that, all we have to do is go meet our friend Dory once again, without getting hurt by these rocks. I had to do this down here, because it's just funny. Look at this. Why? Why is this a thing? Alright, where's our friend Dory at? There it is. Hello, Dory, once again. We are going to need your assistance. Once again. Uh, there is... Okay, the way you control Dory, if you didn't really know it's um dory moves at any direction you're looking at hopefully this is the right place i'm most certainly uh, i am more i am most certain this is the right place yeah it's the right place all right so, yep yeah, let's jump into a pool of mercury once again and now we are welcome to the metal cap switch course that is right we're going to get our metal cap so, um, Metal Cap, um, it's just like being invincible. It is exactly like being invincible. We're basically invincible. This is basically Star Mario, but besides moving fast. And yes, this has a red coin missions too, and this is one of the castle's secret stars. Alright then. Now in the DS version, this place had two. This place has two stars in it, but um, and yeah, the only way you get the second star in the DS version is uh, you have to be Mario. Now we gotta be careful um, being um, what's it called. We gotta be careful in this um, level because, as you can see, this is rushing water, and if Mario becomes unmetalized, I guess we could say that. Then yeah, he gets pushed from the current. Current? I mean current. Alright, let's head back into the Mercury pool. Pool of Mercury. I really don't care how you say it. And yeah, let's go meet our friend Dory once again. I'm pretty sure this is the star. I hope so. Um, as you saw right there, that is another star just blatantly out in the open. Um, I, I think that's the sixth star 
No, that's not the six star. The six star is the freaking rolling stone, rolling rock stone. There's a lot of just open blanket stars in this level. I honestly don't know why they did that. I think it was just lazy game designing. Or game. I don't know, but again, the levels are still creative and fun to play as. Alright, and yeah, basically how you do it, we open these gates right here, and we get another blatantly open star. Super simple. Navigating through the toxic maze. This is one of my least favorite um, stars in the game just because Not because it's a maze, but it's just annoying to move across because um, as Metal Mario You are invincible, but the hit but it's you s but as Metal Mario you still apply to projectile collision meaning like Besides the, what's it called, that fly guy, the fly guy shooting crap at you, if you get hit by like the moles, the moles, um, little rocks they throw at you, you get, you just, you still get affected by the collision from the rocks, and you just act stupid. And also, this is really annoying to get the 100 coin star in this game. Also, uh, fun fact. That is, that, that is the same um, texture for the keyses in, in um, Ocarina of Time. So basically, Legend of Zelda's keyses are... I... I don't know if this is the right star. I don't know if this is the right star. I don't think this is the right star. I mean, we could get it, but I like to go into my numerical order. But yeah, um, this is basically the keys from Legends of the Ocarina of Time. Now I know in the DS version it should. Yeah, okay, never mind. The star is right here because you can tell by the. Yeah, by the. All right, all right. See, this is why I hate it. This is why I hate it. You can tell by the little toxic crap coming off the walls. That's where you know you're going to the right place. And yeah, here we go. This is the right one. We got all of our health back. Wham! Here's the star we needed. I'm bad with my grammar today. Oh yeah. And I think it is the Rolling Stones and then... Amazing Emergency Exit. Oh no, it's just the star we missed. Or no, it's, we basically getting that same star that we saw and didn't get because I like to go through chronologically, okay, no, not chronologically, um, through numerical order, so yeah, it's just basically waste our time going there, um, I honestly don't even need the, you don't even need the freaking, um, metal cap for this world, like, you honestly don't really need it, like, if you know what you're doing, you can navigate this pretty fast, and don't even have the needs to... Use the freaking hat. I mean, but it's again, it's we're 100% in this game, and it's just ideal to uh, to freaking unlock the metal cap because 100% in this. Alright. Oh my god, that was a horrible voice crack. Now this mission is tedious. Here, let's. Okay, now. Because Mario likes to tend to get off the railings! Because for some unknown reason, so let's be safe. Let's see, like right here. Oh, uh, God. Here we go. I don't know, I just had a very hard time with the star in this when I was younger, too. Alright, and then the last star we're going to have in this world, other than the 100 coins, is the Rolling Rocks. Watch out for the Rolling Rocks. Oh, watch for the Rolling Rocks. Super easy star, like, I'm telling you. 
it's super easy but super hard at the same time as you can see a lot of people won't notice that but there's the star we need to get now this star does have a lot of controversy or not controversy the star has a lot of attention because um what's it called a like this is like very popular for the hidden like 1A button start or missions like speedruns. I don't understand, but this guy he talked about parallel universes and how this and that. Again, I already mentioned this, but this, this is the star he made the video on about. Basically, this whole vi that whole video was about that. All right, um, yeah, 21 minutes. We got a lot done, honestly. We started off with I think 38, so we got like about I we got seven stars this whole episode. Seven fucking stars this whole episode. That is a lot. Wait, what? Seven stars? I got the stars and... It was not seven stars. I think we started off at 34? Yeah, I think 34. Or 36. Um, 45 minus 34. I think we got 11 stars. I'm pretty sure we did. Or nine stars. I think we started off at 36. But then again, guys, this is going to be our next world that we're going to go into next part. But guys, thank you for watching. And please, uh, uh, got a burp. Oh. So guys, yes, thank you for watching. And please, 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 for the love of God, I don't know. But um, yeah, like and subscribe if you want more, some more 64 less plays. I'm happy to bring them to you, and I hope you're happy as me watching as watching him because it's really fun to make and I'm actually having a lot of fun replaying one of my favorite games of all time this was my childhood right here this Nintendo 64 game so guys see ya in the next video Thank you.